Joining me now is Kentucky Republican Congressman James Cober. He, of course, the chairman of the House Oversight and Accountability Committee, and he's been leading the investigation into President Biden and his family. Uh, Congressman, thank you for joining me. Uh, now, why do you need to formally launch this impeachment inquiry now? Uh, and are you opening it because you believe you have evidence at this point that President Biden's committed high crimes or misdemeanors? Or is this more about the process because you can't get your hands on documents or compel your witnesses to appear? Well, we'll say this is about process. Uh, certainly the White House has obstructed us every step of the way. We got a letter from the Biden family attorney, Abby Lowell, implying he wouldn't come uh, for depositions because this wasn't a legitimate impeachment inquiry. It hadn't been certified by a vote. So we're going to bring it up for a vote. But with respect to evidence, I think we've had evidence a long time. Uh, that's very concerning to the American people. Evidence about President Biden's involvement in firing the Ukrainian prosecutor. Evidence about the Bidens taking millions of dollars from China, Uzbekistan, Russia, uh, for things that we really don't know what they did uh, to receive the money. So uh, we have uh, accumulated a lot of evidence. We followed the money. We've been very transparent with the press and the American people about what we found. Now we're in the final stages, and that includes depositions of all the key witnesses. All right, well, let's talk uh, about the evidence that you've collected, and let's try and pinpoint exactly how you believe that that leads uh, to articles of impeachment. And we can't possibly address every claim, so we're going to try and focus on one if we can. And, and that is the money that you have uncovered that has come from Hunter Biden, the president's son, and has made it to Joe Biden himself. Now, in each one of these instances, there is a paper trail that demonstrates that these were interest-free loans from the president to his son. So explain to me how an interest-free loan, which one could argue Joe Biden actually lost money on, an example of him being benefited from influence peddling. Well, you say there's evidence proving it's a loan. I've never seen evidence that, that proves it's a loan. Uh, I'm from a banking background. Uh, if, if I loan you $250,000 and then you pay me back $250,000, then I should have a check to you for $250,000. Is that... Am well, I wrong but there on is, that? But there is, sir, uh, you There's have bank not. records. You have There's bank records not. that show that no, the money don't. came from one no, we do account not. into we do the not. other that's account. That's not true. You're mis that's, I, I'm sorry, but that is not true. You're uh, not providing factual information. You're providing talking points from the White House and the Biden legal team. Uh, look, it's very easy to prove a loan. Uh, what they have shown the press... Uh, is, is not proof of a loan. Remember, we released an email last year from a bank examiner that uh, when they saw that $5 million wire from China into what they called a dormant account of Hunter Biden's, uh, they said it was an investment company with no investments, and they uh, needed to know what that $5 million wire was before they filed a suspicious activity yeah. report. They didn't want to file a report against the son of the vice president of the United States. They said, what is this $5 million? And he said, it's a loan. Right. Remember, that's the theme that they've been saying. They said, okay, well, we need the loan documentation All right, but sir, we're, uh, for the bank examiner. You're talking about and a, they didn't have it. You're talking about a, a completely separate issue here. Let's get back to this issue of the loan It's payments. all the same. They've been playing it's the loan card, the same, but yet they it's don't It's not all the it. same. And, and, sir, I want to give you the opportunity <laughs> To, to make this case, but we can't go to seven different issues when we're talking about this one specific but you issue. Well, provide were, evidence of the loan. There were two I provided evidence of where sir, he took yes. the money in. You have no evidence. Flash it on the screen. So, Let's so, see. Sir. So, sir, there, there were the two checks the $40,000 check and the $200,000 check that came from the president's son and into the president's bank account. There was also subsequent bank records which were provided through the committee that demonstrate that there true. were that also is subsequent not, that is, that pieces of information true. that went that, that came from the president to the president's son. No. So no, that you're saying true. that that information's been made up then. Where did that well, information come from? That came from co well, from the committee. I don't know. We haven't seen that information. That is you committee all, information yeah, that is collected from the bank records that, that your committee has just obtained. show the check. If Joe Biden wrote, sir, his so brother are you telling me that you have a? Do you have a blank? Do you have a a canceled check for every wire transfer that's ever come into well, your? Well, we account? have a with that wire that we. Yes, you, you can personally show. Have I can a, show you that, and yes. that's what has been shown is a. There is bank records that demonstrate You're a wire that an exact that same amount of money came. Say, okay. Let's no, move on. They're saying that something from. No, it's not. I mean, look. Are you saying you those say bank records? Okay, sir. Are you saying those bank records do not exist? 
that show the money leaving the There's president's account that shows and going into his son. There's money. But they were money uh, sir, laundering. Answer this specific you question. You see wires is going that, all over the. Is there a bank record that demonstrates the exact amount of money that came from the president's account into his son's account that matches the checks that then went back to him? Does that exist? There's yes or no? There's money coming from. No, no. There's money coming from. That a doesn't law exist. Firm. That doesn't exist, sir. It does not exist. It's coming from a law firm. Who who put the money in the law firm? How do you know the money came from Joe Biden? It could have come from one of Hunter's okay. shell companies. You but, have no okay, idea. Okay, so you're so not. You so you are. You are that saying that that. Evidence. Okay, so you no, are saying that look, that money exists. Look, look, look. That that transfer does, does exist. No, They're in the bank no. records that you, you don't know and what your that committee. Transfer is. Okay, you but don't know sir, what you also don't is. know. You are also suggesting. When you're making the same argument when you say any dime that comes from the president to from the from the uh, the son of the president to the president, you've suggested any dime that comes to him comes from some Chinese company or a Russian company. You do not have specific evidence of where that money has made its way from each stage. Yes, of this. we do. No, we you, have their bank records. It's the same no, you, argument you're you making to wrong. me with Listen, these bank records. The, the American people aren't buying what you're selling. All right, and that's why we have the votes for impeachment inquiry. The, okay. the effort at which the mainstream media is trying to cover this up, it's not hard to prove I'm not alone. trying to cover this up, Just sir. show the money. No, I'm show trying, to, I'm trying the... to get you to explain to me uh, explain to me where your explanation for this comes from one stage to another. But let's move on to a different topic. Well, and you that don't is, have evidence that it was a loan. That's the, that's the, the final the, word. Uh, regard, even if it were a loan, this isn't evidence of influence peddling in the way that yes, you have described it. Yes, it is, because it. they would not have been able to pay the loan back were it a loan had they not influence peddled from China and influence okay. peddled that uh, but let Florida me, health care company. But then, then let's talk about influence peddling and the argument that you're making here. You're saying okay. that Joe Biden, as a representative of the, of the United States government, was able to influence his son's business practices to raise millions of dollars. But all this money that you're talking about being transferred from the president's son to the president while it, is while he was not an elected leader of any kind. He wasn't the vice president and he wasn't the president. So explain to me how that rises to the level of an impeachable offense. The money that Joe Biden received came while he was uh, in the private sector between the vice presidency and the presidency. That is correct. The money and the show companies were created while Joe Biden was vice president. So uh, the money that the Bidens, much of the money the Bidens accumulated from the foreign nationals actually happened while Joe Biden was vice president. We didn't know that till this investigation. We assumed it all happened in 2017 and 2018, but uh, it goes back to 2014. So, so that's how we believe Joe Biden has some problems. And look, we honestly think that this, where is the okay, evidence that while he was vice president, he did anything to help facilitate the creation of these companies or help those companies in any way? Well, he met with all the people. He took his son uh, on Air Force Two a dozen times to meet with many of these foreign nationals. He had dinner at Cafe Milano. He had, he had uh, phone do you have, calls. Do you have any evidence that the vice president was involved in any of those conversations with any of those business leaders where they substantively talked about business dealings? Well, I don't know what they talked about. We'll bring the, the president's son and the president's brother in to, to ask him those questions under deposition. That's why we need to bring him in for, for deposition. But look, we have evidence the president lied. He said he never talked to any of these people. Well, lo and behold, we've got pictures, we've got emails, we've got sworn testimony from Devin Archer. He met with all of them. Okay, so my last question for you, sir, is at this stage, do you believe that you have the evidence to file articles of impeachment, and do you think that other members of the Republican Party agree with you? I think that at this stage, we have more than enough evidence to continue with impeachment inquiry. My job as chairman of the Oversight Committee was never to impeach. That's the Judiciary Committee. My job was to follow the money. We followed the money. Uh, the media has changed the goalposts so many times on what we had to find. Uh, you all said for, for months, okay, find evidence where Joe Biden benefited directly from the influence peddling scheme. We have seven transactions now that show that. And you say, oh, well, there's evidence it's a loan. It's not hard to prove a loan. Again, if I loaned you $240,000, I should have a check or wire to you. What they are showing the press is, is a wire from a law firm. Who knows where the money went into the law firm? The law firm could easily dispel this. Oh, okay, we've got a check from Joe Biden. Somewhere Joe Biden should have a check to right. 
but a lot the of Biden scored uh, that amount. A you lot don't of the claim you're making, though, no, you're, but you're, you're, a lot of this is based on innuendo and suggestion. It's not based on hard evidence, sir. And I think that's part uh, of what bank records don't lie. But, bank but, don't but there's lie a bank the record that shows that. the exact amount going from one to the other. Though, but no, it's, it's difficult. No one's seen those bank records. Publish those bank records. That's, I've seen those bank look, records. It, those bank records are available. It's it's a it was a committee. Yeah, but, it was part of the, your subpoena, sir. You're the one that collected that information. I didn't collect that information. You, you're it was you're 100 percent confident. Under oath, you would testify that you know that two hundred forty thousand dollars came from Joe Biden. You know that came from Joe Biden's personal account. You're, I know that that's what the bank confident. records say. Are you, would you that testify under oath that you don't believe that it's a loan? No. Would you say it's not no. a loan then, sir? Do you have the evidence that it wasn't a loan? I don't know. I, I don't know whether it was a loan or not. There's no evidence But you're basing this on it. You're calling it an influence peddling scheme and you don't even know definitively whether or not it's a loan? No. You, you don't oh, You don't know definitively. It's like you're financially illiterate. I, I, you look like a smart guy on TV. <laughs> Listen. I'm a, I, I'm a banker, you know, I've been involved in, in, in a bank board for, for a long time. The money that the Bidens paid Joe Biden back with came from influence peddling. When they made the deposits but and sir, then wrote the check the same day, they had like a $2,000 balance. I think one account they were overdrawn in and they, ba they deposited the same amount of money they wrote to Joe Biden. There's no question. I don't even being, think the, being, the being, White being House is from disputing that. Being paid back from a loan. I don't think there's any statute that says being paid back from a loan but regardless of where that money that comes from. All right, sir. Yes, it does matter. If you take money from a drug dealer, if you loan money to a drug dealer and that drug dealer pays you back sir, that's, with money that he sold drugs, then you're complicit but you as a don't, drug dealer. That's, the, that's, where the, that's where the gap, though, is. That's where, and I'm, if you, if you can fill that gap, that's another thing, but that's, I think, where many of us continue well, to raise that's questions. That's why we have questions. About the, well, you're the, raising, the you're part, attacking me. Of, I'm not attacking you, you sir. You, I'm yes, not attacking you. I'm not attacking you. I've been asking Look, you serious you questions know, about this investigation that many people have had for a long time. And, sir, I'm sorry, we're running out of time. This is, uh, we had a short amount of time to do this. I do appreciate you being on and answering these questions. Obviously, this conversation will continue. I do appreciate you being here. Thanks for being here. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.